All right, guys, in this video, I will sh walk you through, I will show you how to map your uh, custom and uh, domain name on your Google site. You know, after building your website, uh, it's going to be looking like, like this. All right. You don't want it to look like this. All right. I want your website to look professional, like having your own custom URL like this one. All right. So in this video, I will show you how to do it properly, configure it to work properly with Google site and the GoDaddy. So make sure you stick around. All right. So to get started, you may want to click on this setting icon here and you want to click on the custom domain domains. Okay. And you click on start setup. And here, use a domain name, use a domain from a third party or buy a domain. So if you haven't purchased your domain name, Google is giving you opportunity option to uh, buy one from uh, from Google domains, all right? But if you already got one, just select this one, this first option, and then click next. Already got one purchase uh, through GoDaddy. And so I'm going to be using it as, a, as an example, all right? So now I'm going to type in my GoDaddy uh, URL. You should do your feed.co.uk. So when you type it here, it's going to say uh, your domain is not verified. So first, you need to verify the ownership of this domain name, all right? And to do that, click on this verify your ownership. And then here is going to be, it's already giving me, um, uh, it's already showing me that my domain name was purchased from godaddy.com. All right. So you can copy this test record and go and paste on your DNS um, record um, on your GoDaddy um, account. But I intend to use uh, CNN because it basically work more faster than this. I don't know why, but I... I recommend you using CNAME, all right? So I'm going to click on CNAME. At this, I'm going to copy this one, this host first, copy it, and then go to your domain, to your domains on, on your GoDaddy account and click on this three dot icon and then click manage DNS. All right. And here, you want to click here, add button, and select CNM. All right. So I'm going to paste the first host right here. So I'm going to go back to Webmaster Central and copy the destination, the target URL. And then I'm going to go back to the um, uh, GoDaddy and paste this one to the point. And when you don't click save, all right, then you want to go back here to Webmaster Center. Try to click verify button right here to verify um, the domain name. So I'm going to click here. Yes, you can see it's verified. All right, so you can see um, the domain name has been verified. All right, so now when you return back to our Google site, return back to our Google site, and uh, go back here again. Enter your, your domain name. Do your fit. Let's go that you can. You can see that your domain name has been verified, has been set up. Okay, so what you're gonna do now? Click next. And now, uh, the next thing you need to do here, you need to connect your domain name again to the top party domain register okay so you can see the um the instruction how to do this thing right here but i'm gonna show you in a quicker way how to do that okay so i'm go gonna click done and our domain name has been assigned so the next thing to do here now is to add this domain name ghs.googlehosted.com to your um, dns setting as well on your GoDaddy, okay? And to do that, we're gonna go back to our GoDaddy account and go back to your record, DNS and management um, setting. And then I don't have to click add new one because there's one already here. 
So what you need to do, if you add another one, it will not work because there is another empty one here. So if you want to add new one, you need to delete this one first. But I will say, go here and make edit. So what you need to do is to remove this app and paste this ghs.googlehosted.com, okay? So paste this in here. So copy this URL and keep it somewhere safe while you're doing this, all right? And once you paste this domain name here, just um, click save. And then your, your URL, your custom domain name will be live as soon as possible. Sometimes it might take a few minutes, sometimes it might take a couple of hours or even days. But if it takes more than 48 hours, make sure you contact your domain or register or let me know in the comment, all right? So um, let's have a look to see whether uh, it's live. Okay, let's do www.doyourfaith.co.uk. As you can see, it's not working yet. So we might uh, wanna uh, leave it for a couple of minutes, hour, and come back and try again, all right? So let's quickly have a look to see uh, if our domain, uh, our custom domain name is working. So uh, go to Google and type your domain name again. Uh, do you have fit? Dot com dot uk. And uh, you can see it's working right here. There. So this is how um, you can uh, configure and uh, map your. Yeah, your own uh, uh, custom domain name with your Google site. You can see it's working right here. So if you do in, in if you do have a problem why doing this, make sure you leave me a comment down below and I will reply you. I will get back to you as soon as I can. All right. If you enjoy it, make sure you share with your friend. Give us a thumbs up and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so that we can meet again in the next video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon.